with chief meteorologist Derek Beasley. All of a sudden, I got really hungry. It's nice I got thirsty. <laughs> I got really thirsty. We didn't mention really the main <laughs> the thing that we're supposed to see on a mile. That's right. Exactly. Yeah, if you're outside long enough today, Beautiful you got really thirsty. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, sunshine and very warm, near 90 in some spots. We're likely going to have some areas with official highs today at or a little bit above 90 degrees. So I hope you're enjoying the sun because this time last week, you know what we were dealing with. And it's a far cry from that right now. Looks like they're getting preparation, or at least getting prepared and starting preparations for the Hangout Music Festival down at Gulf Shores there. This is a time lapse. You can see there, looks like they're getting the initial stages of the stage ready and also grooming the sand, getting ready for some of those folks heading down to the beach. Beautiful afternoon. You can see from visible satellite, no clouds. Not one, but we are uh, seeing a couple of puffs of smoke here. I'll rack this through one more time. It looks like right over the DeSoto National Forest west of Loosedale, a little puff of smoke. Also another one over in Stone County, but clear skies and lots of sunshine. Temperatures this afternoon so far about 89. Evergreen, same thing in Crestview, 88 in Milton, 85 here in Mobile. So kind of a toasty afternoon. We're still at 83 and 84. Fort Walton Beach is 79, Destin at 80 and still close to 90 degrees in Evergreen. Forecast through midnight calls for a clear sky. Looks like uh, through later tonight, falling back into the 60s. It was very comfortable last night if you were out and about. And it looks like it'll be the same way as you uh, go out and about later on tonight and early tomorrow morning. So I think we should bottom out around 60, some upper 50s, but beautiful forecast here shaping up. Clear skies all the way back to Texas and Oklahoma. We're already tracking our next storm system. You see that little uh, U-shaped feature there. We call that a trough of low pressure, and that wave of energy is going to move towards our area by Friday, and that's when we're going to see our next chance for rain. So fairly decent chance for showers of storms on Friday and then some scattered afternoon chances for storms here for this weekend. Here's a look at the RPM model skies are clear winds out of the south lightning off by tomorrow morning and then picking back up again for tomorrow afternoon. So a very nice Tuesday shaping up. It'll be exactly like it was today, but by Wednesday we're going to start to see the humidity levels creep up. So we'll have some patchy morning fog and then a few more afternoon clouds. But as you'll see, it's going to stay dry through Thursday, but then by Friday that's when we expect our next opportunity for rain. So here's your forecast for Mobile and Baldwin County. Temperatures tomorrow about like what they were today. Temperatures low 80s near the coast, farther inland, up around Citronelle and Bay Manette into the mid to upper 80s across the Inland portions of our viewing area, Evergreen about 88 tomorrow. I wouldn't be surprised if we end up around 89, 90 again. Chatham 87, same thing for Grove Hill, about 87 degrees. Northwest Florida, mixture cloud and sunshine, about 89 for Milton tomorrow, 90 again for Crestview, 85 Navarre and Destin, and 86 in Pensacola. No rain for southeast Mississippi, a mostly sunny sky. Leaksville about 88, Loosedale, Ocean Springs about 86 degrees. Wade and Hurley getting up to about 87. Great beach forecast again for tomorrow. Water temperature is getting warmer now into the mid 70s with a flat surf and winds out of the southwest about 5 to 15 miles per hour. Rip current risk should stay low. Seven day forecast. No rain through Thursday. Now that'll change by Friday. We're expecting storm chances to start increasing as that uh, energy I was showing you out in the Pacific Coast starts approaching our area. So we're going to have the highest chances on Friday and then uh, some scattered ap afternoon storms here for Saturday, Sunday and next Monday as the humidity will stick around. But it shouldn't be anything that you'll have to cancel your outdoor plans for. That's good to know. It looks fantastic. It really does. It has been I'm fantastic. Speechless. It's been wonderful. Yeah. Thank you, Derek. All right. Teddy,